All right, so you have covered drop spins and different angles and slams, things like that. Your right shoulder, your left shoulder. So we're going to combine a few of those fundamentals that you've learned into a little combination called the egg beater. I don't know why it's called the egg beater, but that's what it's called. So here we go. You're going to start at your right shoulder position. From here, you're going to move into your right slam. And you're usually, when you're doing an egg beater, you're going to make these strong hits. So I'm really going to squeeze to lock into that. And then, from my right slam, I'm going to come back up to my right shoulder. I'm going to do a down drop spin. So I'm doing my right drop spin here. And now, when I come up, I'm going to let go with my right hand. Because I'm going to come up into a left shoulder position out of this. So I'm going to let go with my right hand, and then I'm going to think about actually raising the level of my flag so that I can end in left shoulder and not just in a drop spin position. So I'm just going to raise up out of that spin spot, and I'm going to grab with that right hand on the butt so that I'm ending at a left shoulder position. And then from there, I'm going to move into a left slam. So my left slam, I'm going to lock that in place, really squeezing both hands together. Um, something that can really help you when you're trying to think about squeezing on the pole is think about pulling apart the pole, and that's really going to help lock that in even more as well. Alright, so from here, I'm going to pull it back up to the left shoulder position, lock that in place, and then I'm going to let go with my right hand this time. I'm going to go into a down left drop spin, grabbing, and then when I come out of this, my left hand is going to let go. I'm going to once again let it come out of my spin spot, let it come up to a right shoulder position. So it's going to lift and end at that right shoulder position. And that's your eight feeder. So you're going to start exactly the way that you ended. So you can just do these back to back to back if you want. But let's just review that. So we go right shoulder, right slam, right shoulder, down drop spin, left shoulder, left slam, left shoulder, down drop spin, and right shoulder. And then you can just keep doing that over and over again until you get the hang of it. Okay, I'm going to give you the back view now of your egg beater, just so you can see what the direction would look like and make sure you're together with me if we were spinning in a block together. So here we go. Five, six,